Hi everybody, welcome to another quick tip 10 minute learning video. I'm your host Anthony or Tony or Tech Tony as some of you might know me as. Today's topic what we're going to do is go over how do you obtain the coming soon form from CRMLS. Now real quickly, uh, C uh, NAR uh, as of January 1st of 2020 put in a new policy called the clear cooperation policy rules and what this rule or policy indicates is that agents who are going to take a listing and then begin to advertise a listing must input that listing into the MLS now in response to this rule CRMLS came out with their rules starting May 1st of 2020 of this year called the mandatory submission upon marketing rule and what this rule basically say, says is that when an agent or the listing agent and or listing broker begins to advertise or market a property that they have under contract, then they are required within one business day to input that listing into the MLS. So maybe there's a certain, certain circumstance where the seller or sellers can't show the property right away and they just can't you know they want you to advertise the property that they have listed with you but they can't allow any showings right away so how do you maintain this rule or stay in compliance with this rule while also helping out the client uh, with their wishes for you to advertise the property well in response to this issue CRMLS has come up and generated a new status within the MLS called coming soon. Now the coming soon status is really great because this allows you as an agent to market the property. So you could put the for sale sign on the property with a coming soon writer on it. The listing will be displayed within the MLS to more than 90,000 plus agents of the MLS. So you input the listing, you borrow it as a coming soon. Now the agents within the MLS know that you have a property for sale. And in inputting a listing into the MLS, you have to put in the commission. So the listing agent now has to indicate what they're paying the buying agent um, on the property. Now, the extra bonus on this is that the days on market do not count uh, while the listing is in the coming soon status. So when your listing goes active, that days on market will actually show zero. So which is kind of nice, but the coming soon status is only allowed for 21 days or up to a maximum of 21 days. So an agent cannot infinitely keep their listing in the MLS in the coming soon status. So the coming soon status will end after a 21 day period or sooner, depending on the agent. And then the listing will automatically go to active so that it can be shown or allow showings uh, for the buyers. Now, a couple of other stipulations here is that the there is limited distribution within the MLS or through the MLS, meaning that your listing, if it's in the coming soon status, does not get advertised to any of the public websites like Zillow or Realtor.com or OC Register or LA Times, just to name a cup a few. Also, the listing agent is not allowed to allow showings at all on the property while it's in the coming soon status. So if a buyer wants to see the property or a buying agent wants to bring their buyer to that property, if the property is in the coming soon status, the listing agent is restricted from allowing any showings. The property must then be put to a active status to allow for showings to happen, okay? Now, you may be asking yourself, can I just list the property in the MLS as a coming soon? And the quick answer is yes, you can, but you need a form first, okay? So CRMLS has developed a coming soon form that must be now added or done before you're allowed to even input the listing into the MLS as a coming soon. So where do you get this form from? Well, the answer to that is you need to get it from CRMLS's website. Now, if you don't know where to get it out from CRMLS's website, let me show you where it's at. So real quickly, we're just going to jump right over to the web and we're just going to go right into 
CRMLS's website. So we're just going to go to www.crmls.org. From here, we're going to scroll down on their website to where it says clear cooperation policy resources. From here, when we click on view now, we're going to be taken to that section of their website. From here, we're going to scroll down to where it says helpful resources and we're going to click where it says coming soon form. Now this form is going to be required for you as a listing agent to input your listing as a coming soon. Basically, these are instructions given to you by the seller to allow you to market the property, but not allow any showings for a period up to 21 days. And then you have to market the listing as an active listing. So what's nice about this particular form is that it explains to the seller when you're actually going to allow it to start showing the property. And while it's in the coming soon status, what are some of the stipulations like no showings, limited advertising, there's only a, a 21 day period for the status to be a coming soon, so on and so forth. So now the seller will look at this form, sign and date this form along with yourself as the listing agent. And now you're going to have this form for your records. This will then allow you as the agent to then go into the MLS and input the listing as a coming soon. For any questions or information, please feel free to give us a call or email us at either 949-586-6800, extension 104, to talk to me, or you can email me at Tony, T-O-N-Y, at ocrealtors.org. Have a great day.